Hello everyone, my name is Bailey Ray and my group had religious organization. So my paper is about how to how the Southern Baptists can restore faith in the church. My argument is in the United States there are a lot of social issues that are increasingly eroding the unity of many people and they could use the encouragement and word of God's love for them. Although society will argue that the church is judgmental and hypocritical, Southern Baptist churches demonstrate a desire to help people come to know God as their personal savior. However, the church members can allow personal attitudes and beliefs to hurt their outreach by making people feel judged or not accepted in the congregation. My first reason for the argument the Southern Baptist Confession Lifeway Research Study found that about 53% of Americans had a favorable view of the Southern Baptist, while 40% had an unfavorable view. In the study, half of the young adults between 18 and 29 expressed a negative opinion toward attending a Southern Baptist church. The study also discovered that more people had a better view of Methodists than they did of Southern Baptists. The Southern Baptist Church needs to evaluate their reasons for the unfavorable, unfavorable views of their denomination. In the last few years, there has been a cultural war waged on our country. And it's found its way into the Southern Baptist Church. Junior roles, sexuality, and the definition of marriage has been increasingly being tried, being brought into the evangelical Christian circles. Spiritual leaders have to balance showing empathy, love, and compassion to the people in the world if they want to win them over to the Lord. The Bible is a guide for life. And how people are supposed to live their lives through Jesus Christ. Spiritual leaders are bound to share the teachings of Christ and the, and the correct way to live, but they have to deliver the message in a way that it don't come across as being judgmental to prospective unbelievers, which can be a hard road to balance for the church. There are two sides to this complex argument. First, the evangelicals willing to live with the cultural trends taking place in the country. Second, the Christians determined to resist trends in secular society that is in conflict with biblical teachings. My second reason for my argument is um, conservative Christians take a Christian stand against such things as no fault to the force, extramarital sex, trans transgenderism, and gay marriage. Much to have dismay of some spiritual leaders, surveys show that a number of Americans think the force is morally acceptable and there has been, been a decline in the disapproval of homosexuality and same-sex marriage. These strong objections to these cultural issues is what have brought a more negative view of the Southern Baptist Church. In the Southern Baptist philosophy, the church's mandate is to help their own congregation to live their lives as an example of moral exception to the rest of the country. The church is supposed to be living by the word of the Bible, which tells what is right from wrong. However, these claims are often not supported by what some everyday people believe. God's, God calls on Christians to protest and to share what the Bible claims to be right and wrong, but can lead to people perceiving the church as intolerant and judgmental. 
This can this problem can make it hard for them to reach out and change the lives of others. Do I agree with the perceptions people have regarding the Southern Baptist Church? As a Southern Baptist member, I do not agree that Southern Baptist Church is intolerant or judgmental to the people in the community who they are trying to reach out for Jesus Christ. For the most part, they are supportive to the people they encounter and want to show encouragement to them. However, there are always a few out there that cannot be representative of the entire group, which can give all groups a bad name. I feel churches do need to find more ways to show more empathy and be more welcoming to prospective members as they try to bring them to know the Lord. Churches must help work to restore faith in the institution to better change the lives of other people. How does the Southern Baptist Church restore faith in the church from society? There are some steps they can incorporate into their outreach program to make people feel welcome into the church and accepted by the members. It requires building relationships with people in order to be more effectively communicate your message to them. One way to bring in people and make them feel accepted by the church is to make visits out into the community to fight them. Prayer walks through the community provides a good method to show people that the church cares about, about their needs and has empathy toward them. The Southern Baptist Church has an obligation to try to lead people to ask for forgiveness of their sins and train them in the direction of a prayer life as directed by God's word. However, the church needs to first build a relationship with them and help them understand that God loves them, despise their misgivings. Another step to restore faith in the church is to host a community building assistance for people who are in need. And the church can bring in people to their building to receive help with areas they are struggling with in life. It can help demonstrate their compassion and empathy toward the people. For example, the Southern Baptist Church can host a community Thanksgiving meal during the holidays to help people who cannot afford to buy the food and prepare at home. People tend to remember those organizations who helped those that was in need. And it can make it easier to help them talk about Jesus with. Also, the church can think about doing a clothing drive or a shoe drive to help people who find themselves in need. And that's all I have for my PowerPoint. Thank you. Have an awesome day. Does anybody have any questions? Just comment, reply back to me.